What's up with y'all? Welcome back to the Mo Squad Podcast. I'm Wapmo Jang. I'm here with Master Mike, Jake Renzo, Jojo Damn. Easy. I got our special guest, Makai, aka him. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let's get it cracking. Stay no more is excellent. I'm gonna stay that way till the day I die. Give me a beat, I'm blessing it with my six glow and fire rhymes. All these niggas popping me, all these niggas just be some minds. But that ain't stopping me, it's more time. I'm still finna shine like the sun or a light bulb. Touch me and you'll get burned. All right, y'all, welcome back to the podcast. This particular episode, we're going about um, the discussion of video games and past and present and everything in between, how it affects our lives, other people's lives, and the benefit. And as played on a generation of young folks and older folks for that matter. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to let uh, Emmanuel take a phone on this one because he is a video game fanatic. So, uh, if, you, if you couldn't tell, you know, curvy hat, curvy hoodie. You know, got a tattoo, one up. Always got one up on the competition. What's up? But, you know, video games, video games are part of life, you know. Like, growing up, well, at least all of us at least play a video game once yeah, or twice. That's right? That's true. Most definitely. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, me personally, video games, it, it shaped my childhood. To what it was now, mm. and I want to ask, I want to ask you guys, what are some video games that got you into video games? Like the first video games y'all ever played? That All y'all right, got. So, it? I'm a, I don't know if nobody else, but I'm a big Nintendo slash Wii fan. I love, I love um, Wii. I think we all are. Yeah, yeah, that's my time. Like, I, I would take a, a Wii or Wii U over PS4, PS3 any day. So kind of crazy, but okay. I mean, I would. I'm not. I'm not. I, I, I I'm not into that. Way, honestly, that honestly, shit. Honestly, I like. Honestly. I like being active. When we sports was all like we just dance all that shit. I love that. But but yeah, go ahead, bro. What's up? I could have sworn you said weed. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we're, not even, we're, we're not even five minutes in. You talking about? Weed. <laughs> I apologize. He's drug I addict. Yeah. He got a license now. Act like a fool. He got a license now. Act like a fool now. Amen. All power to God. Thank you, Lord. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Reverend. Um, so, yeah, like I said, like, I love weed. I love weeds. Weed? You love weed? He's like, weed. 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 W I I. You sure? Yes, I'm positive. All right, so, yeah, like, I like Nintendo's. I play um, a lot of uh, Nintendo DS games. I love, yeah, so I'm a big Nintendo slash Wii person. Cool. What about you, Mike? Yeah, so, uh, actually, I, it's funny, cause I think my, I think my dad, uh, has this PS2 uh, game, so I just play that game all the time, but mostly Sonic games, and, uh, the game mm-hmm. Bully, y'all ever heard of the game Bully? Before? Yes, Bully. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that was my game. If y'all, do, if y'all don't know what Bully is, it's basically GTA. GTA yeah, but, 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 like, but like more, yeah, yeah, so that, I just love the game, and then, um, right. of course, like Will said, we all have, we grew up with Nintendos, and, um, mm-hmm. the Wii game. Stuff like that, so uh, mm-hmm. I definitely had Xbox before, like play like Call of Duty and um, what's it called Halo too. So okay, mm-hmm. okay. so okay. yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Halo. All right, so you said that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nigga, spit this shit. Oops. Oh my God, Mike's. You good? Mm-hmm. I apologize. Be um, moving for two seconds. Be moving for two seconds, bro. Oh, um, the question was, you said that. What video games you grew up on when you were yeah, younger? What got you into video games? Basically. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I can't think of this. No, I'm trying to think. 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 So, I'm just going to say that, um... I guess... Can you be dope for two seconds, I guess, please, bro? <laughs> I guess, I guess... I got my cell phone to it. And, like, in daycare, they used to put on video games like the PS2... And you should put on Sonic Heroes and things Dickhead? like that. Sonic. Yeah, Nick Heroes. What were you doing, Nick Heroes? I mean, I was Nick ever since what? Kindergarten through sixth grade. Oh, okay. And I was, I was, okay. Okay. Yeah, I was, okay. I was Dick for a long time, but okay. I'm, I'm gonna say that. And I used to do Leap Pad too when I was yeah. younger. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good times, mm-hmm. good times too. The DS. So I would oh, say yeah. definitely got myself oh, yeah, into it. Yeah, definitely. But I had yeah. some influence too. Like my brother used to play it all the time. We used to play, play with each other. On the game. Like it's on the game. Yeah, on the game, y'all. On the game, on the game. See, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to say that. Yes. All right, what about you, Um, I started out with, like, being, like, playing the DS and, like, PS2 with my cousin. Mm-hmm. He would, like, um, beat me all the time. And then I, like, beat him once and he, like, smashed the game into pieces. But yeah, you did that? Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, it, I, mean, so or one that, I mean, it was so his PS2, so. Yeah, it was his PS2. It's a PS2, okay, but I don't. Yeah, your PS2 is a quiet. I mean, it is. Yeah, I started playing out games like Super Mario Brothers and like um, oh, yeah. WWE. Oh, yeah. 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 Ooh, you speak yeah. my language, yeah. WWE. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to that, we'll get to that. Okay. Uh, 
I can't take y'all. Anyways, all right. All right. What got me into video games <laughs> was uh, my cousin. <laughs> so goddamn funny, bro. Be quiet, Jesus. <laughs> You can't be serious for two seconds there, please. I'm fine. You're not a bro. You're moving. <laughs> I, I, I can tell you he does not do drugs. I, I don't know what he does. He is actually like a crack kid. He he's not a crack right. kid. He's acting like one. Shut up, but anywho, Shut up. as far as I know, at least. Anywho, what I do is, I know, it was PS2. It was a PS2. My cousins had a PS2. Well, the first game I actually got was like, Probably Sonic collections like the OG Sonic games, mm-hmm. Sonic the Hedgehog, all that. It was a classic. And then my mom, she got me a DS. Okay. She got me into Pokemon and well, uh, the rest was history. Makes all those sense. DS games. That is from Dragon Ball. I apologize. I apologize. I mean, I mean, I mean, it's something. Okay. It's something. Uh, Street Fighter? Like, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to do, like, Hadouken? Like, what you doing? How you do it? Oh, a sudden dead. Okay. I'm sorry. Are you trying to do a Chico or something? No, no. Like, what? <laughs> The Pokemon, okay, the Pokemon okay, community will go with with the the with the 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 tonight, well, today. Whenever it gets out, bro. Oops, oops, oops. This is going to be a, a, a long, long, long podcast, in my looks of it. Go ahead. <laughs> we got all day, y'all. All bear right. with us, bear with us. Go ahead, all right, I got a question for y'all, though. What's, What's up? up? In y'all own opinion, mm-hmm. no matter what they say, all right, because they, they might come after you. We love y'all, though. I can't protect you from them. We love y'all, though. What's your... What's the best video game in your opinion? You have to pick one? I mean, you don't got to pick one. Like, 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 you top five, but... Yeah. Where, how are you going to do it? Let's do top three. Top three? Top three. Top okay. three. You want me to go first? Yeah, go, go first. Go ahead. All right, so, like, I'm not a gamer like that, but I do understand, like, the... What's up? What's everybody? What's everybody's talking about? What everybody's uh, hip to? Everything that's in style now. So, my personal opinion, I feel like the top three most popular video games these days are... i say number one, GTA... Number two, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. number two, two K, and number three, the whole Mario Brothers franchise video games. And why do you think that? I, 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 feel, I feel like with the GTA, it's somewhat stigma and like hype around surrounding the games. And I feel like people that play them games, they actually get addicted to them. They really, really want to like continue to see the franchise grow and develop and turn new things. That's why six the most attempted. Whenever, whenever that comes out, yeah. uh, I hope you have a good time playing that game. Uh, next we're year. all still alive. Next year. Time come out. <laughs> it's coming next year, so. And like, uh, next year is a long 2K, time. I feel like 2K is like, it's a, any, any sport game is like really, really oh. has its own little audience. Like sport 2K and like FIFA, all that stuff is like its own little um, audience directed to athletes. And but we're never going to run out of athletes, so. And uh, like I said, the last one, Mario. You, you can't, you can't, you can't not include Mario in top three. Is Mario has been around for ages, literally. It's just, it's a game. It's a good game. Don't get me wrong. It's a good game. Okay. But it's going to make you rage. Yeah. All right. And okay. it's like a voice in the background, like narrating. Yes. And it irritates you. Well, yeah, that come out. Like, not too long ago, really. Like maybe 20, 21, 21? No, I think it's older than that. Really? Yeah. Mm. Makes sense. I finally beat the game like after months of playing. Finally, I look, I could never be I I raged too much at the game. I couldn't. I was like, you know what? This game not for me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna break something. And I'm not trying to. It's like the PS4, PS5. Uh, no, it's like you can, it's like PC and yeah. Earth. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Cool. That's what's up. Yeah. It's like a little music in the background. Mm-hmm. It's, it's supposed to be like peaceful music mm-hmm. in the background, but it upsets. <laughs> it's anything but peaceful. Makes yeah. sense. Makes sense. It's like. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He's like, the object of the game <coughs> is to get over the mountain. And you're like... You know, you're already giving me PTSD. Yeah. <laughs> like, uh, I'm so lost. Yeah. <laughs> me too, Jerry. Don't worry, so don't, don't worry about it. Exactly, bro. Me too, Jerry. But for me, the top three, it's interchangeable for me. But for me, I'll say probably number one, Midnight Club. Oh, oh my God. God. Especially Midnight Club 3. Oh, my, that was a game for me. Wait a minute. Before you say that, did you already say three? Did I? I don't think I did. You said you said one. Said one. Mario didn't get over it. No, I said GTA. 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 Get over it. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Get no, over. I didn't. I didn't know either. The yeah. third one is like um. Man. Man. I'm gonna be a wild one and say Wii bowling. Like that's, that's a classic. That's yeah. a classic. Ain't nothing wrong with that. That's a classic. I definitely be cheating. Yeah. I definitely How you be cheating? cheating? <laughs> I, I, I can't you cheat. You, you, can't see, you can't see on a bowling game, can you? Uh, 
Ah, did you walk up there? You walk through TV? You put through the damn not things? Not the fucking thing. That's the pit bull. Nah, I'll be, I'll be here that joint, bro. I'll be like, oh. That's not cheated. That's not cheated. Yeah, nah, I cheated. Not cheated. Fire, broke up TV or a few. I probably did. I probably did. No one, no my strength. Yeah, I probably did. Yeah. But yeah, what I was doing was like Midnight Club. That, yeah. Like, that got me into racing games in general. Mm. Especially yeah, with the music. I was like, oh, this, hey, this is the game. I that love, I love racing games. Game. Yeah, that soundtrack was I love good. racing games. Yeah, mm. maybe Fred, yeah, a lot of people want yeah. to yeah. yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. Next one. This is in general. I'm guessing every, like, fighting game that I play. But I would say Mortal Kombat. Oh, that's a classic yeah, too. That's classic. Like that. I remember. Did they make a movie about that? Yeah, they did. Like, yeah, they, they, made, they, they made a few movies. Yeah, three. They come in a new one. And that's, that's I got. I'm, we're gonna I get to that, that though. I didn't know that. Right, but it was in the arcade when you play that. Oh, Pac-Man? No, Mortal Kombat. No, 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 no. I thought he was going to tell you like the, the third one. I was talking about. What did he say? No, no, no. This is my second one. Two, two. I was getting to that. I was saying this is in conversation five games in general. Okay. I like a lot of fighting games. Okay. But I was like, Mortal Kombat will be up there for me as like top three. And it was just like playing the arcade, it just, played, it just brought me back nostalgia and everything. Mm-hmm. And my final one, uh, this is hard. Mm, mm. Yeah, this is a hard one. Yeah, final one. I would. I would definitely have to go, not Mario, but the Mario series in general. Like, the whole franchise? Yeah. No, actually, let me change my mind. Because let me not forget where I'm coming from. Pokemon. So, the whole okay, okay. The whole okay. series Pokemon. So, what, what, Mario was honorable mission, but Pokemon's up there. So, you said Pokemon. What's the other one again? Pokemon. Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat. Midnight Clubs. Club. Okay, cool, cool. All right, cool. That's what's up. Good choices. Yeah. Good choices. All right, good games. Good no, games. No, these are good games. But mm-hmm. going back to you, what you said about movements. Yes. Yeah. I got a question. Do you feel like video games should get movie adaptation? I mean, if you do it right, you can. Like, like one good. I give you one good example, one bad example. Well, it's not that bad, but it's a. It's that's something nobody talks about. No I, I give you two. All right, so I feel like if you do a video game movie right, like the Mario, the Super Mario one that um the uh, Illumination made yeah. when was on the movie theater. If, if you do something like that and you pull it off right, it can work out. But y'all remember when they made the Assassin's Creed movie? I never seen it. I don't that. think we did. Nobody, 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 nobody talks, talks about it. No I love Sazza Creek. Me too. So I want a few people get that. I didn't actually like, make little merchandise. I could get a little uh, gauntlet from GameStop, a little hidden and blade stuff. But yeah. I, I want to go see the movie theater and do my granddad. And it was, it, was, it, was, it was a good concept, but like, nobody talks about it no more. Mm-hmm. It, it did not do good at all. Was it good at least, though? I mean, it was a lot of acting scenes in it, but the stigma behind it wasn't wasn't holding up. It's like. The first one, the dude was dead. Well, he was. He, what was it? I forgot the story. He, he died from lethal injection, and then he got put in like a little warehouse, like a simulation room with the his ancestors go back like the Spanish Inquisition and had a fight with the assassins. assassins yeah, ancestors. this is all based in the game. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Cool. All right. All right. Yeah, cool. yeah. So like, I feel like if they if they did a little better job with that, it would be more popular. But nobody. But then again, yeah, it was like in a time where like it was like well, that was 2016, wasn't it? It was, it was, it was. It was time when like big games were, year, two, were two, starting three, to get popular, you know. Yeah, that's what I'm that saying. Good year, I'm saying like I like the idea they decided to make one, but they should like they should either had a better production company or like a better a better uh, writer to actually write the, the script. Better, for better writers, better writers. Yeah, so I, I, the, my favorite one was like the third one when it was in a, the American Revolution. Yeah, Assassin's Creed Three. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, they, they should have kept that plot. They should have kept that plot. They made three movies. No, they made they made one movie, but they made like like six, they, six they, seven they, games. They, no, there's all like a bunch of Assassin's Creed games. Like now. seven of them. Like, like, how many? Is it's like Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed Two, Assassin's Creed Three, Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Assassin's Creed Unity. No, it's a lot more. There's a lot more than that. It's like seven. Like they had Odyssey, uh, Valhalla. Yeah, Black Flag. Yeah, Black Flag was Black Flag here. Did they do spinoffs too, or just um? I don't know. I feel like they did spinoffs. Yeah, it's just a it's a lot. We're getting off topic, but yeah. So like, I feel like (laughs) if if, (laughs) we are, if you do a movie, if you you, uh, do adaptations from video games to movie, do it right, it can work out, but. It has to be really, 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 really planned out. You can't just hop on it like it's nothing. You gotta really sit down and actually analyze what to, what to do when you make the movie about it. Cause like I know all the serious gamers out there don't give a backlash if they don't include some important details. Yeah, but you want to base it off the source material of what you hear yeah, from too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, I really feel like you can make it work now. Back in the nineties, 
Mm. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like nowadays, you could yeah, the Mario movie, movie, the Mario movie. They, <laughs> they was trying to do so many movies on video games, and it was hard because you know technology was different back then, yeah. and CGI it wasn't like it wasn't like the twenty tens. It was like the twenty tens. So now you definitely make it work, and I say yeah, go for it. I'll watch in a heartbeat. I would. I'll watch in a heartbeat. Entertaining. So you gotta do it right though. Yeah. I'll watch it one time. You yeah. Yeah. I know watch yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. You, you, gotta, watch it again. you really gotta stick to the actual game and not go off and make a whole different type of movie because that's that's how you movies be doing that. That's I mean, you, you can do that with books. You can't do that with video games. You can, you can, we can make different different uh, plots with what the books turn to movies, but you can't do it with video games. And that's how they messed up on Mario Bros. 993. That's the how they messed one. it up. That's how they messed it up because um, Mario, Mario, Luigi, Mario. What? <laughs> what? And. The, the villain, name. yeah, that was they had, they had a last name for some reason. <laughs> and the villain, he was a human. It was it pulled the browser or, or yeah, it was Cooper. Bowser. You say browser? <laughs> you say browser? It's it in browser. No, not Bowser. 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 Well, it was, but he was a human. Yeah, and we don't talk about the Goombas. The Goombas, the mushrooms. Yeah, the mushrooms. yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a nightmare. So, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Like, back in the day, I know movie industry was really trying to make movies out of video games, but it was tough. It was tough. If they make a if they make a GTA movie, that should go hard, bro. Yeah, but I would watch it, that. Bro. I would watch that, bro. You already got movies kind of similar yeah, like, like that. I mean, did they come up? Not like an actual GTA movie called GTA... Like, uh, get, get like a new I don't think model, yeah, that. Because yeah. basically, GTA is coming off of stories from like. I will, I will give you. Events. What was that movie called? Where uh, Ryan Reynolds was in it? Pokemon Detective Pikachu? No, no, not that. That, that. that was. Yeah, that, 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 that was basically space. Like, what was it? In a way. But is it? But is it? Oh, Fall Guy. He was playing the MPC. It was called Fall Guy. What was it called? Fall, yeah. The, yeah. the, the Fall, yeah. That was when the pandemic came out. The uh, pandemic. But, but, uh, y'all know Minecraft coming out next year, right? <laughs> we won't speak on that. We don't want to speak on that. We won't speak on that. And then we yeah, got Sonic 3 coming out next year. Oh, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What about you, Mikael? What do you think about movies turning to movies? Video games turning to movies? I don't know much about it. To be honest. Really? I don't. Explain. What? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> How can he explain it? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? It's Angry Birds. It's sweet. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of you. Angry Birds have your game movie before. I've seen um, Mortal Kombat. Oh, Warcraft. You've seen Warcraft? No. Yeah, okay, no, no. That's the I've seen. I mean, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot. I'm surprised they came out with a Monster Hunter one. It was actually pretty It did. Wait, with T.I.? T.I. was in it. T.I. was in it. You seen that? T.I. was in a video game movie? Yes, it was. It was like, it was it was a low budget, but it was an hour. It was entertaining, but I wouldn't watch it again. It was a game. I don't know. <laughs> hey, they had T.I. and then some other people. It, it, it was enjoyable. I watched it, but it wasn't that special for real. What is the longest series? Oh, Resident Evil. All the Resident yes, Evil movies. Yes, that is good. It, yeah. it, but, it, but it did fall off because it, it's t- different TV shows on Netflix yeah. for some reason. Mm-hmm. It, it fell off. They they made like too many movies. and uh, But the, but the big games are good. good. I'll say that. The really? Games. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I didn't know. Oh my god. Honestly, on the real, y'all, when when I first saw Resident Evil the movie, right, mm-hmm. I never knew it's based off a game. Never yeah. knew that. Really? Never knew that. Nah, they they been making bangers. They've been making remasters of games. They made a they made a Slender Man game and they had a movie. Really? really? They made a movie, yeah. Yeah. There, there was a whole case like two little girls they killed killed the girl based on a video game. I thought it was a myth. Slender no, it's a, it's, a, it's a video game. Yeah, it's a video game. Called Creep, Creep Pasta? No, no, it's called Slender Man. I'm saying the, the, the franchise is like Creep Yeah, he, oh, okay, Slender Man's based off Creep Pasta. Yeah. But they made a, and they made a video about. game, and they eventually they made a movie about it, but between those two times, the like, two little girls, they killed their best friend because like, they got addicted to the game. And they were like thinking Slender Man was real and shit. They, True story? Yes, yeah, so it was on the news, literally. I remember reading the article like uh, last year. It, it, was, it was some two little white girls. It was two white girls, so yeah. <laughs> No offense to white people, but still. I got a question, though, if I could. What's yeah, that? If I could. How do you think um, AI is going to affect video games? I think it will make production easier, but the quality of the game probably will kind of go down a little bit. Mm, that's, that's a good one. Well, it can go both ways. It can, go both ways. it can, but it's like... Like, like you know, AI, like, they got AI-generated character, all that. Mm. And it's like, you could just do it, like, just put in a keyboard. Yeah. I'm going to say this. 
Now, I remember, well, a couple years ago, right, before the pandemic, right, mm -hmm. and these kids to play violent games, and, and used to go out and, like, try to do the same thing. Yeah. Now, how do y'all feel about that? Like, these kids doing that? Well, like, I, it's a good question. like are you blaming that video games caused it, or what are you trying I to mean, say? I mean, I feel like, to mm -hmm. me personally, like, I feel like parents should have you know, yeah. pay attention yeah. to what their kids like, yeah. so, like, watch like, like be mindful what your kids playing. Yeah, so like like GTA for instance, Call of Duty. Mm -hmm. I mean, they got like raised for a reason, but sometimes like, parents don't raise. Really well, look, they like, well, look some of the some of the parents they be they be going to game with their kids. Some of the games on employees they be like, "Are you okay with the console in this game, sir?" Because like they be going with their parents. The parents will be caring. They be letting them have it. Yeah. I mean, I, th I feel like it's if the, if the kids like me, thirteen, twelve, thirteen. I, I think that's when you can start giving them like more intense video games. But like, you give them, you give them stuff like a. I, I don't see GT. Well, I mean, GT has like stripper. You know, yeah, I feel like, yeah, like 13. Yeah, but there's 13. like other games that are like yeah. violent. Yeah, if, like, yeah. if it's like really a lot of gore in a game, yeah. like really like Mortal Kombat. I feel like, like those that. games would like direct yeah. like, like older kids, like 13, 14 year olds, but like if you're like under 12, you should like shouldn't stick to like them violent movies. Yeah. yeah. If yeah. I was a parent, I wouldn't give my kid like the first like really intense video games like 13 years old. I mean, yeah. you really think like, vi like violent video games will make someone violent? I mean, no, it's like, yes. if, if, the, if the kid yes. is smart, if the kid is smart, they should know the difference between right and wrong. Yeah, he has a point right Yes. Right. Yeah. If the kid was raised properly, they should know the difference between right and wrong. Here's the thing. If you know the difference from right and wrong, it doesn't matter what game you play. Yeah, yeah exactly. I mean, you know. even if you, like, you keep them away from those games, if you don't know right and wrong, have morality, mm -hmm. it doesn't really matter. You're kind of going to end up the same way. Yeah, yeah. You, you could play Animal Crossing, the most friendly game out there. And you still and get a psychopath. Still a psychopath. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you got a point, you got a point. That's, that's, that's a good Dang. point. That's a good point. I, don't I wouldn't say it's the video isn't making by. I would say yeah. it's more like the upbringing of the person, like how their lives outside, of like playing video games, like yeah, like, do they live in like a their environment, their environment, all that. Their environment. Like do they live yeah. in like an abusive household? Like some know? people, some people, some, sometimes video games the only way out people like yeah. to actually cope with their situation. Yeah. Like some sometimes people, it helps people escape from like the reality of things. Yeah. And like they feel like they're playing as that person. Mm -hmm. Maybe communication is probably better. Like after the game, or when you're playing, you should you should you should sit down with your child and just say, "Hey, like, we'll play with them. Play with them." That too. We yeah, can yeah, explain yeah, like yeah. this is only a game. Like, please just be mindful. Don't be robbing people and yeah, taking exactly. their cars and driving. Maybe right. you can't do this in real life. You can do it only. Maybe there's repercussions in real life. <laughs> and don't don't play it. They gonna fight. Well, since. Until some people do that. Some people do that. Some people do that. I yeah. can't do that. I, I, I gotta get my sleep. I couldn't do that. Like I play a game for like, like an hour or two when I was younger, and I go to something else. Uh, no, I, I I can't say anything. I'd be up to like three. Oh, uh, we know you do. We know you do. <laughs> you know you do, man. Kind of like real hard on the game. <laughs> be like, hold on, get, get the this. whole headset on the game. Hey, hey, hey. So all my game is out there. We can't end on a loss. That's all I can say. Yeah, it makes sense. They do be addicted. I ain't gonna lie, they do be addicted. Yeah, yeah. Didn't one of us beat you on Mario Kart? That was Sean. That was Sean. That was first off. No, no, I was. That was Smash. Bros. That was Smash. That was years ago. That was. I was like, how y'all could beat me in Smash Bros. Right now? That's all. I'm saying. No, wasn't. No, no, no. One of us beat you in Mario Kart. Yeah, that was on your birthday. We did. We did. We did. You know somebody who playing the game for the game. We did. And you was like, dang, I thought he was in second place. Yeah, he was mad. You wasn't the first. He ain't win. He was mad. He ain't win. You ain't win. So okay. I don't want you to remember that, okay? You ain't, you ain't, you ain't take, win. Take I'm not going to win every game. Take your L and keep it moving, baby. Take your L and keep it moving. <laughs> loser! Loser! It's like, no. Nah. I'm going to bring my Squish right now, and we're going to play it again, all right? Bring it on any day you time. Right. Bring it on. Bring it on. Yeah, stay tuned to that. We're going to have a Mario tournament. We're yeah. going to see who better, who better in Mario Kart. We're going to see that. Uh-huh. What's with that? What's with that face? Somebody that shit, bro. Ah, nah. You want to talk trans? Come on now. Come on. <laughs> but anyways, take it back. You can take it back. You take it back. <laughs> but anyways, I want to say this. Do you think video games are like being addicted to video games are as bad as being addicted to drugs? No. Like, what? Like, you like, they're on the same You're level. not hurting nobody but yourself yeah, if you do drugs. Your, it doesn't affect your body or whatever. Yeah. So, I mean, Actually, right? you can hurt other people. Do. Look, you can hurt video games for real? Yeah. Cause like, you sit like hours on well, video games. If you like, stand up, all day, all now the thousand was in that. Dark? Yeah, 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 that. Okay, actually, okay. This, this one yeah, dude was, he was sitting on his game for like 25 hours straight. He got so mad he lost. He stood up. 
all that blood went to his heart so fast, it gave him a heart attack because like, he was sick for so long. That's possible. All, yeah. yeah, all the blood was concentrating his lower body when he stood up after so so many hours. He was eating chips and so like that, all that fast food, like, sodium, high sodium foods. He stood up after like a, a hell of a lot, hell of a lot of hours, and the, all the blood came back so fast it rushed his heart and killed him. He had a heart yeah, attack. you don't realize Damn. Doritos and Mountain Dew are like yeah, they're popular, nothing, but... catered towards people who play video games. You know, yeah, it's like, I like, like in the early like like two thousands, they were very cared to people who play video games. Where's yeah. your proof? Where's, Where's your the proof? proof? It's on the back. I swear, you just okay. I mean, that's, you know, this is marketing. <laughs> yeah, marketing. Like if you have a huge corporation, you're gonna try and find Yo, your own audience. You right because yeah. Dorito bags do we have in like Call like of Duty? Halo, games. Call of Duty. You're all right, right though. Xbox. I mean, that's crazy. I mean, I mean they still, they, yeah. I mean, they still do that. Yeah. Yeah. They're going yeah. to find like. Yeah, like a pizza place do that too. Like pizza restaurant do that too. Yeah, they all do that. They do. That's real. Yeah, they'll do Wow. I'm saying like to answer the question, I feel like drugs are more and more dangerous because like you can. In theory, you can actually hurt more people when you do drugs because you can like go out and have an accident if you're like on some somebody yeah. you're driving. But you're honestly you're only hurting yourself if you do video games because like you're you're to yourself. I mean, thing. technically you're both. Uh, you're right though. Yeah. You're both hurting yourself too with both of them. Yeah, but like it's, it's but more. It's like you gotta like the odds limit of, how many how much you play. The you odds know? of hurting other people is more higher when you do hardcore drugs in real life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 drugs are way way worse in my opinion. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. if you look at the effects, not just, like, weed, but, like, if you go into, like, cocaine and, like, meth and... Yeah, that shit fuck you up, that shit fuck you up. Yeah, fuck that, right. man. You, know, you can get, like, high off meth and literally, literally like, rip your eyeball out. Mm-hmm. And, like, just keep walking away. Yep. It's crazy out here, y'all. Yeah. It's crazy out here, y'all. That's beat. That's beat. And the lesson of the day, don't do drugs. Stay away from drugs, kids. Stick to the video games. Stay away from drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. <laughs> cool, cool. Uh, oh, I got a good one. How do y'all, I don't know if y'all know about this, but how do y'all feel about pay to win games? What you mean, like if you win the game, get money? No, no, no. Cash price? Basically, basically means, say it's a new game come out, like, let's say Call of Duty game, new Call of okay. Duty game came out, right? Okay. You just got on the game, you got on today, right? You started like level one, mm-hmm. right? And you, you battle other people in like Team Death Match. Okay. You get like sniped from the other side of the map, from someone else, who, the game just came out today. Okay. Literally just came out. Okay. Okay. Right? But they're already like, what, level 35. Okay. Damn. And that's from paying for, like, like probably the best guns, the best skins, well, all that. Well, look, so it's like, it's not required, right? They don't own time, right? I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, they, they pay, they, they use their money, their credit card. But look, they have the option, right? You, you don't have to do it. It's like, they give you an option to pay for, right? I can but, see if they, like, give you a game, it's like, you have to pay so and so much amount just to get to the next level. I I, I don't fuck with that, but mm. if if they give you the option, it's not not a mandatory option like you pay to get more more uh more accessories and stuff like that. I can see that because you know it's not it's not like a requ- um mandatory thing to do to, mm. to beat the game. But I feel like if you're if you're like if a video game comes out it says you have to pay this amount just to get the next level, that's a scam right there. Mm. It's a scam. Yeah. Any games that, that I do look. No, there's a lot of games. Yeah, it's, a, called, it's called microtransactions. Yeah, but look, this is there's nothing. It's nothing called a different different uh different pack. So if, like, say say if you, uh, a game comes out, it's a really popular game. Like they release like a new pack when you. Oh like, yeah, I think you're talking about like DLC. I'm not talking about DLC. Yeah, DLC. yeah. About I, 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 I know what you're talking about. Yeah. I'm saying like I give an example. So if you like if you get a game you're playing for a long time, it's been out for like a year or two, and then you like a new upgrades coming out. Everybody can buy. You can buy it after what you already got. I, I like that because like it's too much. Just a lot of games do that. Mean, Jurassic World Revolution do that. Jurassic World Revolution. Yeah, yeah. No, no, they do. Yeah. I guess you're saying, but it's like, I mean, you gotta think about it. Like the game, kind of, you try to have a fun time on the game, relax, mm-hmm. and you already get killed over and over again by someone who just. But look, don't they spend their car on it? But look, don't they? Uh, don't like different levels of difficulty. Like, uh, I, I feel like I know they, some games. If they do that, they should only be on the advanced level. Of yeah. when, when you set the game, which one you do level? Easy, difficult, very difficult, advanced. Like they should be on a certain level. But not not online. It's like it's like, online. You don't yeah, online. Oh, yeah. Okay. yeah. But it's like it's like how would you feel knowing like you lit? Everybody literally just got the game today, like, mm-hmm. and you already get killed by someone who's. I wouldn't like, 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 would like it. I would. It would, it would be kind of annoying. Yeah, they got like all the, the best time, time, all the same. best care. Like. I, I, just, I can't get mad at the game because the the, the, people, the people bought it with their own money. I can't really get mad at the game, but mm. it's like I can I know what to do next time. I know how to avoid them areas. Yeah. <laughs> so let me ask y'all this: Do y'all think buying a game at a store is obsolete now at GameStop? No. Uh, GameStop not. will never run out of business. GameStop will never go out. Of business. I, I wouldn't say that now. I wouldn't say that. Because GameStop, it got more than just games. Game. Going up the street, we got collectibles. Out of the next, which one? Yeah. 
No, he didn't. Like, Brainy one. Like, see, CDs it did. That was one of Brainy one? Yeah, it was. It was? I never knew it was it. Like, you know, like, CDs and, like, records and all that shit. Like, it probably will gain value. Like, actually, yeah. living in this. Yeah. Oh, like, uh, like, uh, uh Yeah, yeah, it'll be, like, yeah. really, like, because now a lot of people will have the physical copy of it. They always right. want to purchase the digital copy. Mm -hmm. But even here's the thing. Now everybody's buying games online. Yeah. It's kind of no point of going to a store and actually buying a game now. I, mean, I don't think, like, GameStop is probably going to be out of business in, yeah, like, which, in the next which, 10 years. I, I'll low-key miss those days where you had to wait outside of the store before a new game come out. You see that commercial yeah. on TV come out? You got to plan your day around looking at that game? Yeah. Yeah. No, those were fun days. I miss those times. Those were very fun days. But you know what? Fossil Fighters. <laughs> I love that shit, bro. Those games should be expensive at GameStop. $60. $65. No, no, there's $70. For, for a disc. For it a disc. It should be expensive, and it'd be like, you want a discount? I'm like, hell yeah, I want a discount. <laughs> only, on, only on Christmas and my birthday, only time I saw a $70 CD sitting under my tree, my, my hand. The only time yeah, I feel man. like... I like GameStop. I'll say that, but I just... If I, if I was, when I was younger, I wish I was so much wiser. I had so many DS games. I sold it. Only got like probably nine dollars for them. You go, what? you go eBay. Yes. What? No, no, you go, you go, you go get it. You try to sell games. Right. They gonna give you like probably the least amount for all. You games. definitely right. I'm trading my PS3. You can, you can definitely go to eBay. I got like. Yeah, I didn't know about it. I was like, or, or take it to a flea market. Get more I was 11 years old. What? Not on flea market. It's your game. It's your game. Nah, I don't know. Well, it depends what flea market. Or like a video game convention. So somebody gonna pay more than not video games. They not gonna pay like a hundred dollars for that joint. Maybe if you got the right games, if you got the right games, they will. That little thing. A hardcore collector, a hardcore collector will pay a pretty penny for them video games. I mean, it depends on what kind of game it is. I give you that. I give you that. You gotta be like direct to the right crowd. The average person not gonna like buy like a whole bunch of video games for that much money, but still. We see cosplay or whatever you call that, uh, just dressing like that's like our favorite yeah. gaming. I mean, it'll, I mean, it'd be cool. It'd be cool. It'd it be would. Cool. It we're would. Times the sun, you know, can we? But well, we can. We can go yeah. like video game tournaments. If it's Darius, like, yeah. Super Smash Bros. I'm probably going to lose. They're they, they they going off of that shit. I, I, I can see a fist fight breaking out over some money, like a like a thousand dollar, a fifteen hundred dollar cash prize. Just, I mean, I know you would do something like that. I mean, you would probably break my neck over that game. I would. 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 I no, not even bet. If you could, if it's like a five dollar entry fee and a grand prize, like fifteen hundred dollars, you do it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I would it's like super smart. Yeah, I do it. You would be mad. <laughs> I'll, I'll be having practicing for months. It's, it's like a thirty minute timer. Months. A thirty a thirty oh, minute yeah. timer. I'm rusty. It's right? gonna be a thirty minute timer. <laughs> People be inventing new tech every day. All right. I'm rusty. All right? At least you admitted that. I like that. I, recall, I, I would go to the mail tournament if you had like a video game. I would go. Yeah. I would. I would. I would, I would record that shit too, bro. That would be fun. Yeah, I would. But you know, you know, it's, we about to roll, like closing, yeah. like closing theory. I got one more question for y'all. Mm. That's a good one. So, if you could design a video game, how would you want to oh, design it? Dang. And uh, and a few examples, you know, you want like RPG, action, fighting, simulator, first person shooter, just just name. Oh, all right, so I would I would like an action adventure type game. I would like have a have a have a scope. What? What is an RPG? You know RPG? <laughs> what does that stand for? He, please tell me, okay? All serious. What does that stand for? What? What's so funny? What's so funny? Will Squire, you don't know what an RPG is. Do you know? I'm not role play. Hey, you know? Role playing game. You know that? Yeah. RPG okay. <laughs> role playing game. Okay. Is that, <laughs> is that fucking funny? Is that funny? You on the same boat, right? That's going to the highlights, yo. That's going to the highlights. That's going to the highlights, yo. That's going to the highlights. Yo, really? That's going to the highlights. on the floor. Look, not everybody know the thing, okay? All right. We got to say what we got. It's not that funny, okay, y'all? Oh, my God. What's up? What's up? What's up? playing game. Wait, so wait. That's uh, that's just like, um, oh, we did, um, for your birthday. That's just like a that's VR. That's VR. VR. Yeah. Yeah. That's, 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 VR. that's virtual reality. You know what that's there for, right? You know what that's there for, right? Yes. All right. All right. All right. Go ahead. All right. Go ahead. All right. Go ahead. Go ahead. All right. Look, look. We're right by right with it. But look, so I think I would do like an action adventure game, like a mixture between sci-fi and horror. Like, like a horror game. Like, like, like fighting. Like, 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 like,
a little bit of problem solving in there here and there, like different puzzles. For me, um, action packed, sci like you know, science fiction, fantasy, um, definitely drama too. Put a little bit of that in storylines, and um, yeah, I think it'd be pretty cool. Definitely fighting scene too. Uh, okay. I think it'd be pretty yeah. badass, something okay. like that. So. Okay. I would do like a, a mafia drug type game. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you Italian. You Italian. That's right. So, you Italian. The Godfather. Would, the Godfather. I'm, I'm gonna give you off the camera fuse. I'm gonna give you off the camera fuse. I would definitely do that and like drive in a car, drive everywhere, like do certain type of missions. Like training day. Like, yeah, like just train, like that. Training yeah. Day. So similar to GTA Five, but I yeah, love so games. Inspired games. by GTA Five. Exactly, yeah. but I would do something like that and do like a lot of storylines and. Okay. Ooh, that shit would probably be fun. Yeah. It would, it would, it would. Be fun. Um, my game would probably be like similar to GTA. Mm -hmm. but like okay. I could compete with it, but like the goal of it would like to make it be extremely realistic. That makes yes. sense. Like yes. most realistically as we guess. And like don't people like for video games, don't they like use like a uh motion capture suit sometimes? Yeah, yeah somebody yeah, yeah. 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 For me, I would say I probably want my world be like a little bit like Legend of Zelda, like an open world game, yeah, but it's definitely classic. more fantasy based okay. on it. I love fantasy. It's like, uh, it'll be, yeah, it's fun. It's oh, yeah, a great game. It fantasy, is. Open world it fantasy. Is. It is. Like Harry Potter or something. I like guess it would be kind of like Baldur's Gate, but I mean, that's a great game, by the way. You should definitely play it. Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate 3. It's, it's a great game. It's basically like Dungeons and Dragons. Already, already. Yeah, I heard. My head is hurting. <laughs> My head is too many dang old games. Dang. Okay. <laughs> All right. But oh, yeah, it'll definitely be open world, uh, fantasy survival. I don't know what I'll name it, but you know, okay. it's up there. Up there okay. anywhere. Right, cool. So any, any game developers want to. Uh, Holla at my game? boy. Holla at my boy. Yeah. Holla at my boy. Easy. Alright, we're about to wrap it up now, y'all. But appreciate y'all tuning in this podcast. More episodes on the way. Don't get like, comment, subscribe. Most of our way out. Take it easy. Peace. Be kind to people. Alright. Hey, why are you laughing like that? Stay no more is excellent. I'm gonna stay that way till the day I die. Give me a beat. I'm blessing it with my six glow and fire rhymes. All these niggas popping me. All these niggas just be some minds. Huh? That ain't stopping me. It's more time. I still finish shine like the sun or a light bulb. Touch me and you'll get burned.